hello everyone and welcome back to my channel how's your day going how's your life going how's your quarantine going i am literally rosing my mind i'm looking at people's videos and i'm checking their rings because i work in jewelry so i'm looking and i'm checking their rings and i'm looking oh my god that is a three carat diamond it is this this color i wish she was showing it a little bit closer i can tell and then i look at some other people and i'm like oh that's a garnet oh that's a that's an amethyst oh that's that and i'm just like oh my god i am crazy i'm losing my mind because i actually even want to go in their uh, comment section and say hey is that a diamond and how, how big of a diamond is that is that a three carat um did you have it appraised do you know we do we're doing appraisings you can come and see me if you want to and we can do appraisings for you oh by the way um how is that how come you don't have a wedding band yet don't you want don't you need a wedding band to go with that one well i'm like losing my mind in today's video we're not going to talk about jewelry we're just going to talk about blue blood palette and we're going to play with this one today and just uh try to create a simple nice beautiful springy look although i don't use a lot of blues but today i'm like oh why not maybe i can find something that i really like in here and just go from there and without further ado let's go this into it is really beautiful i love the blue colors and everything and also this thing i love a coffin i'm that crazy girl that loves coffins that loves skeletons plus i'm from romania so we have dracula so we, we're kind of we're bodies you know what i mean so slipping in a coffin all right <laughs> let's see this um yes beautiful colors i'm gonna be honest i never been very interested in looking at this palette so i don't know that much about the colors but it's definitely looking a little bit different when you see it in person than seeing it online 18 shades in here i believe this one is 52 dollars you know, I already have my face done, if you're interested to see how I achieved this really beautiful, glowing, amazing skin. Um, go ahead and check the link down below. I'm going to leave it down, uh, down for you. I'm going to go with, uh, I believe, I'm just going to try Priceless. I'm also going to put untouchable right over here from over here right under that I'm gonna go with this taste this one right here could it be maybe that I put it on top of the other ones that it looks this light because in here, it looks pretty dark. And it doesn't look not even close to that. On my skin. So... Don't know. Like, look at, look at this the color. Like if you go with the thing with your finger, it does look way darker than uh, what I have on my eyelids. But I'm not gonna go and pick that up with my finger. You know what I mean? Like I don't know. Maybe it's my brush. I have no idea. Maybe. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. Anyway, so let's see. I don't like how it looks right now. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go and get a different brush because I don't like how this looks. I'm gonna go minty and just go over it. Oh yeah, minty looks really And I'm not a professional makeup artist. I am an esthetician. Not a professional makeup artist. Okay. 
you the one that don't like my videos. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get this. I am using Makeup Revolution uh, Conceal and Fix Light in Light Beige. I'm thinking to go with Crystal Flush because it's really pretty Crystal Flush right here or maybe even this one but I think to put that one in my inner corner so I'm going to go with Crystal Flush. Oh yes, I like it. I look good. I'm gonna go back to this one right here so I can put it right under my brow bone. I wanna make my eyebrows before we go further. So I'm using Kat Von D uh, Signature Precision Pencil. Alright, so now we can continue. I am, I still, I feel the need to make something a little bit darker right here. So, I think I'm gonna go in. Or, you know what? No. What I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna do a liner. So, I'm gonna go in with Undertaker right here. Okay, that is so much better now. <laughs> and I'm gonna put a little bit, I'm thinking maybe a little bit of the minty under my eyes. Just wanted to flush it a little bit. And then I'm just gonna go with Undertaker and just lightly apply a little bit of that. So in my inner corner, I feel the need to highlight it a little bit, so I'm going to go with, what is that? Coolie Coolie Man? Mm, not quite a big fan of that shade. Clean it up a little bit. Ooh, I like it. Alright, now what I'm gonna do, uh, let's close this. We're done with this. We're done. I'm gonna put a little bit of mascara. Better than sex mascara. I'm gonna try this thing. I have I had it in my collection for a while. I haven't tried it. Yes, this is in Luminous and it's Too Faced Chocolate Gold Soleil um, bronzer. And it looks really pretty. And it's chocolate scented, so yes. The only thing that um, I'm a little bit hesitant about this is that I see a lot of shimmer in there. So. We'll see how it's gonna go. I'm gonna put a little bit on my nose. Good. That looks like it, like, 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 you, literally bronze. <laughs> that's how I look when I get bronze. Yeah, it's true. In the summer, that's how my skin looks like. It is so pretty. I love it. Oh my god. How come I never play with this one? Oh my god. Wow. That is gorgeous. That is gorgeous. Love the color. Love the look. Love everything the application about it the scent it smells like chocolate it is looking really beautiful
Wow. Okay. I'm going to put this one probably on my desk just to kind of use it all the time from now on because that looks gorgeous. All right. We're going to go in with a little bit of blush. I'm not going to apply too much. I'm just going to go oh, just a little bit, tiny bit. This is ColourPop Kissing a Frog from the Disney collection. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Just a little bit of flush right there. Yes. Love this! Yay! And then I am going to go with my powder a little bit more. This is Becca Hydromet Set and Refresh Powder. Okay. And because I've used something under my eyes that I'm not a big fan of, I'm going to go in with something that I usually like to use. It will be KKW, the brightening powder. I'm just going to go a little bit with it. There you go. And then for my lips, I'm going to use KKW Lip Liner and New 2. And then I'm going to go over with Melted Chocolate from Too Faced. And this one is in the shade Chocolate Milkshake. And we're going to set our face with Mystified Hydrating Facial Mist from Gerald Cosmetics. And that's my look for today. Do you like this look? You don't like it? Let me know if you don't like it, why you don't like it. So, uh, that's basically yeah. how everything looks like. Let me show you. That's how it looks. I love this bronzer. But yeah, those how that's how my eye look came out. I really love it. I mean, I thought at the beginning, I'm like, oh, it's not going to be good. But no, I really love it. And I think this is very springy. Summer is springy. <laughs> but yeah, that's how everything looks like. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being here. And thank you so much for subscribing. We're almost there. We're, we're very, very, very close. Thank you so much for uh, being here and subscribing and liking and commenting. I really appreciate it a lot. And I hope all of you are doing well. See you next time. Bye.